Good Sunday evening. So, like I promised in the tutorial from uh, the other night, we are going to do Gavin's TV slash art tray um, while he's still in the hospital recuperating. Um, he's doing much, much better. Um, there's no bag anymore. They reattach him. But because he hasn't used um, his bowels for over four months now. And yes, I know this is a shitty conversation. <clears throat> yeah, dear. Okay. Yep. But anyway, because he hasn't, there's a bit of a blockage. So they've got him. They're not worried about it. They, they've just got him up. He's got to do a lot of walking to stimulate that those muscles up again so um he's doing better um so anyway so i thought um i'd cheer him up for when he came home and have this surprise done for him so the colors we are using tonight are the winter white my winter white as the base color we are using september sapphire northern light september sapphire and you know what I guess because I've got, I've got so many colors. My products, Color Passion, Artie Sue, you know, I've I've had it all. I use so many different colors that I don't um, always remember the certain colors. Well, I just mixed this up. Don't even know why I picked September Sapphire, but I just mixed this up, and look at how freaking beautiful this color is, and. I know the camera's not even doing it justice because I can see what you're seeing, but you can't really see what I'm seeing. This is just beautiful, just beautiful. So we're using September Sapphire. We're using Kalamalka, which of course is one of my very favorite colors and it's got a shimmer to it. We're using our Platinum Blonde as our silver. And we are going to use Color Passion's Top Cell White. Okay, so this is what we're doing. Do I have a clue of what I'm doing? Any idea? No. So we're just going to go with the flow with this. If the first, uh, if it doesn't turn out nice the way I'd like it to, I can always go over it when it's cured. So what I have done is I have stuck tape around this way so um, the edges won't be done, but that's okay because I will go over them with, um, <coughs> excuse me, still getting rid of the cost. See, that's the only thing is the cost with colds and this time the pneumonia stick with me for a while, but anyway. Um, this way I can go over it with my silver um, leaf pen. Okay, so I'm going to start off by pouring our winter white and just pour it all over. It is our base color. And we will start with this and just spread it out. I'm hoping the four cups is enough, but I've got extra resin made up. So if I have to make some more up, I will make some more up. So guys, How's your weekend been? Do you see the snow that Newfoundland got? What unbelievable amount of snow. Like, I don't know what's going on, but it's a record from them. And yes, Newfoundland does get a lot of snow throughout the winter. Most of the Maritimes does. They're right on the, you know, the coast. So... Um, they do get a lot of snow, but this was all at one time. Um, 
and just unbelievable. They can't get out of their houses, their driveways. They, there's videos showing them plowing the roads. I don't even know how they know if they're on the road, the big plows, because you can't see. Like, this is deep, really deep. People, but you got to love Newfoundlanders. If, you, if you're not from Canada and you don't know, Newfoundland is, is a province in Canada, uh, right on the coast, um, down east, not west, east. And they are the most wonderful people. They have a sense of humor like no other. And I mean, they are joking about this. Yes, I know it's serious and I I know whatever, but these people, they have opened their front doors and of course there's snow right up to the roof. So they've carved in, it, some people carved in little spots for their beers and oh my God, they just made it so funny but the thing that I thought was just hilarious they're more worried about because they knew this was coming so they all went and you know you do your groceries and you get stocked up well they ran out of potato chips in all the stores and so they're calling them storm chips and if you were lucky enough to get storm chips they're more worried about having a potato chip famine than they are the snow and you just got to love them. Just love them. My neighbor next door, Corey and Darlene. Corey is from Newfoundland. And I'm telling you, he is a hoot and a holler. He can get you laughing nonstop. Okay, so the base is down. So I'm going to start with my dark blue. And I'm just going to... Do some design work. This is the September Sapphire. And then I'm going to add the Kalamalka. Okay. And then I'm going to add a little bit of the silver, but not a lot because I want to leave it and see if I need it. And now we're going to add Color Passions Top Cell White over top of my color. Okay. And now we are going to blow this around and see what we get from this okay and like I said if I'm not happy with it I can always go over it again with having this here so let's heat it up first I'm getting some major cells already from um, the two whites Okay, so let's move this around. I think I'm due for a new heat gun because this doesn't seem to be blowing. It's hot enough, it's just not blowing very well anymore. Wow, there are a ton of cells. Okay, so, <coughs> excuse me. I'm going to, um, I don't want that to bend over, so I may cut this. Do I want to do the edges, guys? No, no. I'm going to cut that a bit, so... It doesn't stay 
Oh, you can't even see it, but there's a corner here that wants to bend right in of the tape that wants to bend into, there we go, to the resin. And I don't, I don't want that, so I'm loosening it up. Okay, so I'm going to add a little bit more of the silver in some places, like as far as I'm concerned over here, there is too much of the dark blue. And let's see. Heating it with, well, let's do it with the heat gun. The silver has given me my threads, but it's reacting to the top cell white, and it's giving the effect of almost like um, glitter. It's broken up and, and passed over. It's actually really, really cool. So yeah, I am going down the edges here. So you know what? Let's take the tape off. What I'm going to do first, so it doesn't get all over the legs, Oops. Let's put this quickly underneath so it's not all over the legs. And take the tape off. And let it do its thing. Then it's, I'm not getting that round. Rounded edge. There we go. So do I want to add any glitter to this? I don't think I need glitter. Hmm. I love these colors here. Look at all those cells, guys. Look at the action happening between the winter white and the top cell white. Just amazing. Just friggin' amazing. That top cell white is really Let's see, okay, so we're getting lacing from the winter white, and we're getting these amazing friggin' cells happening from the top cell white. And usually the top cell white does lacing too, but, well, I guess in a way it is too. It's just, this is just amazing. I love these two products. So very cool. I hope Mr. Strachan likes this. Luckily, thank God he loves blues like I do. I'm going to just try one thing. And that's breaking up my silver a little bit more. With the torch. Excellent. Excellent. Now, I'm not sure if I want to add anything to it. I don't know if there's really... Um, hmm, I really don't... I don't think there's much that I would like to add to this. I want Mr. Strachan to be able to put his while he's not well, or, well, while he's recuperating, put his paper and his pencil down without any, you know, distraction. Well, he'll be distracted, that's for sure, but 
without anything being underneath it. And so, yeah, I think I may leave it just like this. If he thinks that he would like something on it, I can always um, come and do another layer on it. But for now, I think I'm just going to leave it like this. And it's covering the sides very nicely. I'm glad I waited, though, to take the tape off a bit because it's it's moving slow. It's not one great big, you know, rush over the sides. So, very nice. Okay, guys, so that was easier than I thought. I really wasn't sure what to expect, but we've got some major cells and lacing happening here. I love the Kalamelka with the white and the silver that um, September Sapphire is a gorgeous blue, really gorgeous blue. I'm very happy. Okay, come on down. Come on down. Actually, I'm going to bring you around so that you can see it without, hopefully, without glare. And you see all those cells happening? Just some really, really awesome cells. And when I take the picture, if this stays this way, when I take the pictures tomorrow to go with this tutorial, I'm not going to know where to start because there are some gorgeous cells all over this. But look at this beautiful Kalamelka. Look at that color with the white and the silver, just gorgeous. And that um, September Sapphire is such a brilliant blue. Very, very nice. I really, really love these colors. And oh my God, I love this passion top, so white. Okay guys, so there we go. That is our job done for today. And then I'm picking up the parchment paper that I sent flying. So, okay. So don't forget, guys, we have a wonderful challenge going on for Valentine's. You've got until February 8th. Uh, join our group. It is Resin Artists Without Borders. You have one of three chances to win a prize. And of course the prize is Resin P Pigment Canada products. Um, there's the first, second, and third prize. There's when you join our group, the very top post with the balloons is explaining the details in the contest, but it's a lot of fun. We've had a few entries already. I know a bunch of people are working on projects right now. You've got until, well, February 8th will be the draw. So um, get your stuff in. Come on, guys, join our group. We're a lot of fun. And yeah, I do a lot of these uh, challenges with prizes and stuff throughout the year. So um, it makes it fun to be in the group. So come on over. Thanks for joining me. Thanks for all your well wishes for Mr. Strachan. I have passed them on. He's very, very grateful to you all. And um, we will see you soon. Have a great week, guys. Good night.